Hi, I'm Rhoda. I'm in the Maiden Studio. Today I've got a few tips for how to get the most out of your ceramic clad pan. We start with our five-ply stainless clad base that chefs know and love. We've applied a first-of-its-kind ceramic coating to make it non-stick. I've been testing this thing for about a year. I've probably cooked 10,000 fried eggs, so I've learned a few tips along the way. I'm gonna walk you through those tips and let you know what to avoid when cooking with your ceramic clad pan. Always preheat your pan over medium low before you add the food. This is gonna help to activate those non-stick properties and make sure that it's ready to cook. This pan is compatible with gas, electric, and induction cooktops, and don't heat your pan without anything in it. You wanna add a little butter, a little oil, or even water to help gauge the temperature of the pan. Don't use cooking spray because it can build up over time. I'm gonna use butter. If you're watching the butter, if it's just kind of sitting there not really doing anything, the pan is not hot enough. If it's starting to melt, or oil is starting to shimmer, then you know the pan is ready to cook. And if something is smoking or burning, then you know your pan is too hot and you need to wait for it to cool down before you continue cooking. Now that I know my pan is preheated, I can adjust the temperature a little bit. I can turn it up to about medium max. You really don't wanna overheat your pan because that'll affect its nonstick properties over time, but it is oven safe up to 550 degrees Fahrenheit. Just don't put it under the broiler. Something that I learned about ceramic is that it's more heat conductive than traditional nonstick, which means that stainless clad base really conducts the heat up through the ceramic more than your traditional nonstick, which means you don't need to use a very high heat to get a good sear on a steak to crisp up some fish skin or to make perfect scrambled eggs. Something I love about the stainless clad base is that if I need to adjust the heat a little bit, the pan will respond very quickly. And when you're cooking with ceramic clad, just like other non-stick, you wanna use a silicone, wooden, or nylon utensil. Don't use metal because you don't wanna scratch the surface of your pan. All right, my eggs are cooked. And once you finish cooking, be sure to let your pan cool completely before washing it to avoid warping. Thanks for watching Maiden's Guide to Cooking with Ceramic Cloud.